Be a content creator with passion. For a long time, I considered myself an internet marketer. And I also considered myself very burned out. I wasn't earning the truly passive income yet. And I wasn't writing about things I loved either. Then I changed the way I saw myself and started to think of myself as a content creator. A content creator is very similar to an internet marketer. They do effectively the same job in that they are creating a brand and promoting it online in order to subsequently profit from sales or ads. The difference is that the content creator does this while keeping the focus purely on creating great content, on the brand and on the logo itself, on the quality and value being shared via articles, etc. The content creator is also far more likely to delve into multimedia as a videographer or as an app developer. The marketer creates content, but when you become a content creator, you start to hone those skills, and you place much more emphasis on creating something worthwhile. Not only does this put you massively in demand and massively help to grow your brand, it also helps to improve your work satisfaction. If you can create videos with high production value, then you can build authority and relationships with your audience much more effectively and quickly. If you can create stunning designs for WordPress sites and logos, then you can sell any product far more effectively by selling a dream rather than just an ebook. If your content is passionately written, people will want to read it, and even Google will pick up on signs like reduced bounce rates. Now you'll be in demand as a marketer, because you can offer things that other spammy marketers can't. Not only that, but you will be happier because you will be pouring your heart into something you love. So that even if it doesn't take off right away, you'll still feel rewarded and you won't give up. If you view internet marketing as a get-rich-quick scheme, then you will be disappointed. In all likelihood, you'll create low-quality content and a spam-filled website. Instead, blog with passion and you'll build trust and become far more effective at selling. Think about all your favorite websites, blogs, and marketers. Do they seem like they're in it to create a quick buck? Content creation with passion. What sets the great blogs apart from the mediocre ones? What makes you bookmark a blog and go back there on a daily basis rather than seeing it once and opting not to look at it again? There are several things that separate the weed from the chaff. And knowing that difference is crucial if you want your site or blog to fall into the category of the greats and bring people back time after time. But the most important thing of all is to blog with passion, and you will find that everything else is born out of this, right from the heart. Think about the blogs you like, and head over to those sites for a read. What does the writing have in common? Chances are that each of them feel like they're writing to you. They feel like they're enthusiastic, real people who have a grasp on the subject, and that are interested in what they are writing about. These people, by and large, are not blogging because they want to get rich. They are blogging because they genuinely want to write about those subjects. Can you say the same? If you currently write articles by looking up ideas online or on Wikipedia and then rewording what you read, then you aren't really offering anything interesting to the reader, and you aren't entertaining them. Your site will feel lifeless, and if you don't sound enthusiastic, how can you expect your visitors to? Make sure that you want to write each topic, and if you can't find the motivation to write on a particular subject, then perhaps it's time to think about changing the title slightly so that it is more interesting. Keep on punching. If you write with passion and you write from the heart, then this is what's going to keep you going long after you've started to worry that your site isn't going to be a hit. If you can keep writing despite the fact that you aren't sure anyone is listening, then this will mean you're unlikely to ever give up, and it will mean that the site stands the test of time. Otherwise, You'll find that you lose interest in your site as soon as you start to feel deflated. Write for you, and not for anyone else, and you will be much more likely to be successful. Be creative. Likewise, your site design and everything else should be creative, and it should look like some thought has gone into it. Did you have a vision and a passion for your site before you created it? Or did you just use the first template you could find? You need to ensure that when someone sees your site, they are seeing something exciting and different and that has obviously had a lot of care and attention put into it. That way, you will be able to ensure that people realize the passion you have for the subject before they've even started reading. One thing I have never understood is these people who will spend time and energy learning to code and coming up with inventive and genius algorithms 
also that they can make a spam bot or content spinner. Why not put that same time and energy into making a good site in the first place that people actually want to come to? To do this, you need to love what you do. And if that comes across, then other people will want to visit your site. Put it out there. You also need to be just as passionate with marketing your site. And to do this again, you need to have passion for it. Make sure you are immensely proud of your site so that you can't help but bring it up in every conversation. Accomplish this and you will ensure that you are able to market it better. If you are ashamed of your site, on the other hand, and don't want people to see it, then quite simply, you won't promote it as much as you should, and no one will find it. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.